Hi. Hi. Welcome back to our channel. My name is Rhoda Michael. Please subscribe to our channel. Put on your notification bell so that anytime we upload video, you will be notified. So guys, today we are going to do garden tour, okay? We're going to show you what we have going on in our garden, okay? So don't go anywhere. Please subscribe to this channel if you are new here. And also put on your notification bell so that anytime we upload video, you will be notified. And if you are here and you smash this um, video, please smash that like button and drop your comment to support this video as well. All right, guys, let's get started. Guys, guys on this race bed, we have our sweet peppers here. And we have our garden eggs, which are from Ghana. And some of the peppers are getting ripe, like this one. Yes, guys, so we have our sweet peppers. I'm going to give you a closer look, okay? So we have some that is already ripe as you can see it looks super good and some are also working their way out as you can see yes so everything looks good and the plants looks healthy and it looks cutie right look at that look at this has a lot of peppers on it and they look good and this is my garden eggs this is from ghana but guys i don't know whether we're gonna get some harvest before the um cold weather start but i'm just crossing my fingers because i can see that some has bros um blossom but others too has not so keeping my finger crossing okay but so far it all looks good and we are hoping for the best on this race bed we have our watermelon here, and we also have our Ghanaian garden eggs. And on this side, we have this watermelon, which is getting ripe. So guys, yes, look at that. This is my watermelon bed, okay? I have quite a lot of them here. So I have a lot of watermelon here okay look at that two hiding in there and this also hiding here and look at that right there too okay and let me show you the huge one over here look at that very huge okay and it's due for harvest because you can see that that is dry up and that is a tip that shows that your watermelon is ready to harvest okay yes so besides that we have our garden eggs also here okay we have some the blossom coming up yes guys as you can see and that is spinach okay so somebody asked me why is that your spinach are larger so when they start coming and you don't plug them it's grow bigger okay so then it become a little bit harder than the um regular spinach so you have to cook it more than you will cook a, a regular spinach okay so in between i have some spearmen so guys the beginning of this uh yeah i harvested and cut all the um spearmen but because the roots were still in the soil look at that they <laughs> regrow themselves again yes guys so this is all that we have on this raised bed okay so we have our watermelon and we have our garden eggs and we have spearmen and some spinach so guys on this raised bed we have our sweet potato look at how it looks guys <laughs> it's all over okay so this sweet potato we planted it somewhere in may and it's doing amazing well as you can see we have the greens going it was first attacked by japanese beetles but now i can see that they've um catch up and everything is looking good so i'm gonna keep it like this okay till um the end of october 
and we will think about harvesting it okay all right guys so so far everything looks good right here guys on this race bed we have our cayenne pepper and we have our ghost pepper and the difference you can tell is that the cayenne peppers have dark leaf and the ghost peppers have um, light leaf and on this place we have the serrano pepper and the difference is that it's so big that they'll go the kaya pepper and the ghost peppers yes guys so this um race bed show all the peppers and these are the spicy one okay so the very spicy and hot one we have here is the um ghost pepper and as you can see it has already started and look at that yeah so for those who doesn't know ghost pepper this is how it looks it's very very spicy okay in fact if you don't like spicy thing you can't even use a quarter you have to use like one eighth of that it's very spicy and we also have our cayenne pepper as you can see look yeah so just one plant you can tell how many peppers it has on it and we have some already ripe okay yes guys so we have a lot going on in here as you can see and we have a serrano pepper as well you can also see that it's also ripe so we'll be harvesting them and we'll show you um what we have harvested so this is how the ghost pepper looks when they are not ripe okay as you can see i have a lot on this plant and it's growing really really well all right guys thank you so much for watching this video from the beginning to this point we so much appreciate your time and we don't take it for granted so guys thank you so much thanks for all the love okay yeah so give this video a thumbs up share it to your friends and family don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet drop your comment also to support this video and so we come to you with another video stay healthy happy garden bye so far i would like to apologize to all my garden fans for not uploading a lot of garden videos this year because i was a little bit busy and garden videos i could only do it during the day and not the night but i'll be starting uploading them soon thank you